Welcome to Kale Mohorra with me, George Galloway, on Al Maidin Television, coming to you from London, talking about the special relationship. I'm joined by a group of distinguished experts, one or two enthusiastic amateurs like me. Britain has always had a special relationship with the United States of America. Although I used to say it was a bit like the special relationship between Miss Lewinsky and President Clinton. Unequal, one-sided, with the junior partner always on their knees. Tony Blair asked me to stop saying that, and I did for a time, but it became irresistible. Until the moment in the London School of Economics when I returned it to my script, only to have it pointed out that Miss Lewinsky was in the audience as a student <laughs> of the London School of Economics. Of course, uh, Mr Blair's relationship to first Bill Clinton and then George W. Bush, he was nothing if not promiscuous, Mr Blair, was extremely close. The question is, will the relationship between the two blonde bombshells, Boris Johnson and Donald J. Trump turned that special relationship even more intimate. Certainly warm and fuzzy if the opening chapters are anything to go by. What will that mean, if so, for Britain? What will it mean for the rest of the world? Is the Anglo-American alliance going to join up policing the world with the British side as the president's brain. The president's brain otherwise being missing. Donald Trump can't string five sentences together. Boris Johnson can do so in Latin. So it may very well be that the long-held British ambition to be Greece to America's Rome might be about to be achieved. <laughs> 